another deadly shooting in this country, this one claiming the life of a Los Angeles bishop. Beloved as a peacemaker in his community, Bishop David O'Connell was found dead in a home in Hacienda Heights. Police now investigating. ABC's Zareen Shaw is in L.A. with this developing story. This morning, parishioners in a Los Angeles community are in shock after an auxiliary bishop was killed in what is now being investigated as a suspicious death. To pray for all the people who are buried here. Bishop David O'Connell of the Archdiocese of Los Angeles was shot around 1 p.m. in a home in the Los Angeles suburb Hacienda Heights, according to officials. He was so soft-spoken. He was a humble soul. He, he was not the type that would have confrontations with nobody. O'Connell was pronounced dead on the scene. Deputies from the industry sheriff station received a call here, uh, an assist fire call of a person not breathing uh, and bleeding. O'Connell was a prominent leader in the community for 45 years. Archbishop Jose H. Gomez, who knew O'Connell, calling him a peacemaker with a heart for the poor and the immigrant. And the shooting death of the Catholic bishop coming just days after two men were shot leaving synagogues in Los Angeles. Police calling that shooting hate crimes, saying the alleged gunman who was in custody targeted both victims because they are Jewish. And so back to what happened last night. Many parishioners, they just felt moved to go to Bishop O'Connell's home. They said prayers and they shared memories, but they also had a lot of questions. This bishop was known as a peacemaker, and they just don't know how this could have happened. And officials, they just don't have a lot of answers right now. Eva? Zareen Shaw for us there. Thank you, Zareen. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.